do some Hollywood waves in the style of Miranda Kerr. So I've washed um, Abigail's hair in Moroccan oil repair shampoo and conditioner and then I applied Moroccan oil before I dried her hair straight and then we're going to start by curling with our tongs. Just section right down the middle and I'd use inch sections wide. Curling with the bubbleless curling one. From ends leaving a gap between your room. Hold for a few seconds. When you get to the side you're gonna take back, only curl at the very end leaving a longer room section. Once you have curled all the hair, you're going to go through and spray with hairspray. And then I have got these two quick length pieces. I cut one of them into half. So they've both got three clips on. This is colour 6 slash 613. So we're just going to section down. I'm going to start with the clipping of some in, in the nape of the neck. If you start by teasing at the roots, just to give the clipping extra grip, then I'm going to take this quick length, which I've cut in half. I'm pre-curled. with either straighteners or tongs. Section another section. And again, tease at the roots. Because Abby's hair is quite long, this will just give extra body and volume to a natural hair. So we've got our last quick length, which is the full 12 inch wide. Which will go ear to ear. shape it round and then you can get an idea where you need to put the clips. Open each clip. I'm 
and then I'm just going to get my hairspray again. And to give Abby extra volume, I'm just going to section around her crown and continue with the back combing and tease a little bit at her roots. Now if you just take your tango teaser and we're going to start to brush the curls out to create a wave. So if you brush all the same direction, brush them to the ends. Start at the root and then brush to the ends and brush the ends one direction. On the roll. To finish off, get any ends that have gone straight from the brushing and just recurl. And to finish the look, just sweep the hair to one side. 